Well, several places in the Portland metro area are opening up to help those in need stay cool. The Portland Rescue Mission is among those cooling shelters and will be offering additional services to people during the dangerous weather conditions. Fox 12's Jeffrey Lindblom joins us in studio with more. We're told staff has been planning for this weather at the Portland Rescue Mission for a week now and will be operating on a 24-7 schedule throughout the entire heat wave. And people we spoke with today say they can already feel that heat. It's really hot today too, already getting hotter. It's beautiful out here, beautiful in Portland, Oregon. I think it's actually pretty nice because I'm, I don't have to deal with it all day. Andreas Bowers, who's out walking his dog, says he's happy to be heading home. Then getting back to air conditioning. AC being something not everyone has. I worry about it, really. While Thursday's a hot one, Muhammad knows temperatures are expected to rise, dangerously heating up the Portland metro. Three, four days in hundreds. Muhammad says that he worries about people who are living in his building and don't have AC like him, especially those people who are older, and really encourages people to utilize cooling shelters like the one across the street from him, the Portland Covenant Church, if they get too hot. So for them, it is really going to be hard. Muhammad is talking about people who are living on the streets, who he worries may not have easy access to resources and information during the heat wave. To protect themselves from this heat. He hopes people hear the news that Multnomah County is opening three cooling shelters Thursday, two in Northeast Portland, the Portland Covenant Church and the Hugo at 6221 Northeast 82nd Avenue as well as Cook Plaza at 19421 Southeast Stark Street in Gresham. And I think that things like that are fantastic. Thank God. The Portland Rescue Mission will also be open 24-7 during the heat wave, offering cooling services to people and additional beds. TriMet is providing free rides to people starting Friday who are feeling the heat and looking to escape it by finding shelter and shade. So many people, you know, they really feel hot. So we want to get them air conditioners just as quick as possible. And then I drink a lot of water and fluids. Some shelters will also be offering free water to those in need. All of these resources intending to help people, including the most vulnerable populations. Stay cool. Those who need transportation to cooling shelters should dial 211 for help. And the Portland Rescue Mission is asking for water donations to help serve the most vulnerable people during the heat wave. And check out our website, kptv.com, for the cooling shelter addresses I mentioned earlier. Reporting in studio, I'm Jeffrey Lindblom for Fox 12 Oregon. Jeffrey, thank you.